Hello, I'm Anthony Hudson. For today's match, we have Adelaide and Melbourne. Today's game from the Adelaide Oval. Terrific weather for finals footy. Providing special comments for today's game is Gary Lyon. Thanks, Hutto. Gaz, as someone who's played in the grand final before, what goes through the mind of these players? They'll just want to get their hands on the ball early. If you start well in a game like this, it gives you the confidence to play well for the whole day. It's a Melbourne making their way onto the ground. The banners are ready for the players. It's a big, big field battle today. The team that can get on top in the middle of the ground will walk out with us today. The cheer squad's hard work is paying off. The banners are looking great. Two teams competing for football's biggest prize. What about the crowd? How happy are they? Captains prepare for the toss of the corn. Melbourne wins the toss. We prepare for what shapes as an enthralling contest here today. And the grand final is underway. And here we go. It's Adelaide taking on Melbourne. Has it now. Gives it to Paxman. Spent that one before she earned it. A chance here to convert for the Demons. Might be too far out to score. Going for goal number one. Does well to cut off the kick. Allen kicks it out of the defensive 50. Slams it onto the boot. The ball spills from the tackle. Kicks hurriedly. Picking it up was Zankak. She couldn't get the hand pass away, so she just threw it. Doing well to intercept that kick. McAvoy with a spearing kick. Under pressure and keeps it alive. Burt wins the ball in the air. Goes with the kick. Pierce down some space and marked. Looks up with the kick. Mills collects it. It's a free kick for Adelaide. The kick from Mills. Didn't get low enough with the tackle. Going for goal number one. The kick connects with the post. Birch searching for a teammate. Plays on. Works the ball out of the 50. Marks now and can send it back. A chance here to convert for Adelaide. 50 metres from home. Move it on. 
Going for goal number one. Well picked up. Doesn't carry. And through from behind. Adelaide, two. Lead Melbourne, zero. Unsure of their next move. Birch plays on to herself. Now with a low spearing kick. Winning the ball in the air was Mariner. Big kick required from this distance. Going for goal number one. That's the sort of goal that can get the team up and about. Congratulated by your teammates. Adelaide gets the first goal on the board. Adelaide needs to be more aware of the opposition set up at the stoppage. Their hitouts are getting cut off too easily. Coaches love to see that kind of tackling pressure. He fair to mop up. McKinnon gathers it now. Pierce dug out the loose ball. Thompson sees off Pierce. Nice mark under pressure. Might be too far out to score. She decides to go for home. They are happy with that effort. Bird's got hands to it. She's excited about that one. Great start by Adelaide. We resume hostilities. Swatson gets around Mr. Invisible. Nice. Foley didn't mark it. Ball collected. What can you tell us, Gaz? I'm really enjoying this one, Hutto. Piers gathers it now. He intercepts the ball well. Mills moves it now. Miffin finds the ball on the move. Looks to move it by foot. A great mark taken there. Uses it by foot. A chance to reload the attack now. Goes by foot. Marking in space. Van Hagen puts foot to ball. Takes the mark. Decides to kick. Picked off the deck. Goes for territory. Gets a quick kick away. Gets the loose ball. Just dismisses her opponent. She's got the football now. Dug it out. Contests the hard ball. Applying the physical pressure. Puts on a bump. That's holding the ball. Showing some really good pressure there. Marks now and can send it back. Slams it on the boot. It's marked by Paxman. Adelaide just can't seem to attain possession of the footy. They're getting outmarked all over the ground and as a result find themselves losing this contest. 45 metres out. She can put it through. Doing well with the mark. Uses it now. Marks all of them. Now with a low spearing kick, drops the mark. Dug out the loose ball, penetrating handball. She gets it back. With a driving kick, releases by hand. A bit too hard with a push, and it's a free kick. Punches the kick. Big tackle. Van Hagen just throws. Gets some distance on the kick. And the mark will be paid. Adelaide are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Takes the mark all by herself. Uses it across half back. Open opportunity for Mules. The handball hits the target. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? This is a great game, Hutto, and we can just sit back and enjoy it. Hammers it. Considine scoops it up. Ball up in the centre square. McKinnon just swats it away. Gathers it now. Has to do better than that in the mark contest. Sinks the slipper into it. The tackle slipped high and results in a free. Puts it on the boot. Good mark there. 50 metres from home. She drives it towards goal. A great mark taken there. 
Moves it by foot. Consider oh, use the body to take that mark. Adelaide have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of the game if they're to stay on top. A big contested grab. Moves the ball by foot. Couldn't complete the mark. Allen getting in on the act. Receives the handball and takes off. Hanks gives it to the player running past. Gets the loose ball. Taken well at ground level by Downey. Downey throws the ball away. Spears the ball. Hands that ball to the opposition. Well collected with a driving kick. She takes aim. Suckers it through for a goal. That's her first. She's enjoying that goal. Melbourne get there first. It's great to watch her. Though. Plenty of excitement. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. We're back in the middle now. Thrashes it. The loose ball picked up. Takes possession. Downey hacking it out of there. Wins the race to the ball. Just manufactures what she could. Kicks it out of the defensive 50. Marks in a bit of space. Adelaide have got on top in the marks. They've been able to control the ball in the air. It sees them in this position. Mules elects to kick. Finds the loose ball. Doing well to intercept that kick. Looks to move it by foot. Oh, what a hang! Kicks to the square. Nice hands. McKinnon releases the ball. A chance for Phillips. And the mark has been taken. 25 metres out. Thompson lining up now. Directly in front. She likes her chances from here. Look at them celebrate that effort. Adelaide doing well at the moment. We're back in motion. Pierce clears the contest. Quickly onto the boot. Shear couldn't snaffle it. Clears the ball from the contest. Ends up turning this ball over. Hatcher has resources out wide. Ran hard to take that mark. Goes with the kick. Good body work to win the mark. Gives it to Framey. Showing some really good pressure there. Just gets it onto the boot. McAvoy with an easy mark. A patient and weighted kick. Adelaide haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning total that way. Ball spills. The ball mopped up. Phillips quickly onto the boot. Takes the mark. Plays on quickly. Finds this one all by herself. Cramey will have to put everything into this one. She takes aim. The drop punt sails between the big sticks. That will settle her nerves. Gets her first on the ball. They are starting to stamp their dominance on this game. She celebrates hard after that. Punched away. Gets the handball away. Rushes with the kick. Good mark and looks to send it back. Decides to go to the middle. A strong pack mark. Moves it by foot. She gives chase to the footy. Downey unable to lay the tackle. Cordner takes a strong mark. Slams it on the boot. A chance to gather the ball. Gives the old don't argue. Getting in the way was Smith with quick hands. Makes it somebody else's problem. Scoops up the ball. Pushes through with power. Chips it towards half forward. Strong with the body and wins the mark. Puts it on the boot. Strong mark in the contest. Works it across the ground. Nice work from McKinnon. 
McKinnon has resources out wide. Looks up with the kick. Great mark under pressure. Lining up for goal. Uses it now. Pierce leading the race to the loose ball. She has the ball. Blinking by hand. Constant pressure and rewarded. She can take off after that handball. Pierce will be the recipient of the free. Takes that one strongly. Campbell kicks it. Van Hagen. Fair to mop up. Collects the loose ball. Allen rushes with the kick. Fumbles the ball. Phillips distraining past and gets the footy. Hands that ball to the opposition. Going for goal number one. The kick ends up in the post. Melbourne reduced the margin. Looking for options now. They chase after the loose ball. Slick with the hands. Finds a way through. Cuts the kick in board. Thompson had it, lost it. Radzic with the ball. Three to go through and through behind. Adelaide starting to exert some dominance now. They lead 27 to 7. Players move as they look to provide an option. Bird goes with the kick. Dishes it off. Opportunity for Downey. Uses the hands instead of the body. And it's a free kick. Moved on by McAvoy. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Foley with quick hands. Picks up the loose ball. A low stabbing kick. Coughed up by Allen. Tarrant kicks in heavy traffic. A solid mark from Campbell. Goes by foot. She gets above the crowd. Foley with the mark. Alex to kick. Nice work for Cox. Over the top of the pack. She spears the ball. Takes a strong mark. Drives it inside 50. Picks it up. She heads for home. Into the post it goes. Adelaide lead Melbourne by 21. She gets above the crowd. Mithin uses it by foot. She finds herself in space and marks. Finds this and marks well. Gets a hand in. The boundary line wins this race. What can you tell us, Gaz? I'm waiting for something to change the way this game is going right now. McKinnon throws the ball away. Pumps the ball long. Picks it up. Hurried kick. Nobody can hold on here. Uses it by foot. Foley looks to get onto the football. Intercepted. Oh, read it best. Great tackle. Outstanding pressure. Chose to kick it. Considine sets her sights on the goals. Puts boot to ball. Takes it well. Adelaide just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Does well to cut off the kick. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Decides to kick. Stuck the mitts out there and held on to it. Kick by Pierce. They can create from this. Picked up by Smith. Foley couldn't complete the tackle. Van Hagen takes it well. Van Hagen sends one up towards the wing. Moves it on. Got the hands free. They can link up now. Missed the target. It's a turnover. She decides to go for home. Marking in space was a kid. Distance won't be a problem from here. Going for goal number one. Oh, look at her. She really enjoyed that one. That's three in a row for Adelaide. 27 points the difference.
She knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. She did really well there and gets the reward. About to resume play. Pierce won the hit out. Drives it out of the pack. Smith wins the foot race. Movement by hand. Mithin. Hurried kick. Takes a simple grab. Keeps going. Tarrant elects to kick. It was always pushing that post. And pushing it so hard, it hit it. Melbourne now only trailed by 26. Good mark by Bob Hagen. Adelaide have managed to rack up a big number of marks, and it's easy to see why they're leading this one. The ball spills to Campbell. Mops up the loose ball. That is a stunning goal. That's two now. Finding her feet in front of goals. Celebrating hard. Melbourne reduced the margin. Back in the middle as the rucks go at it. Pierce thumps it forward with the ball now. Pierce brushed off easily. Ball gets cut off. Just gave it away. Quickly onto the boot. Campbell applying the pressure. Great attack on the ball carrier. Cox elects it. She's picked up an injury. Going straight to the rooms, doesn't look good. Smith kicks it. O'Day drops the mark, dug out the loose ball. Gary, how did you see that opening quarter? Melbourne have a big quarter coming up. Can they find a way to get on top in this one? continues to dominate this contest. She's having a fantastic game. Nerves will be settled by now. Second quarter action underway. Umpire ready to resume play. Punched away. Is in her possession. Over the top of the pack. Shear will kick from beyond the 50. Great mark. Driving kick forward. Pierce looking to track down the footy. Going for goal number one. A time to celebrate. Mills making the lead bigger. Her teammates rush over. Now they lead by 26. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. She just can't get out of the action. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? I'd really love it if these teams took the contest to the next level. The loose ball scooped up. Going for goal number one. Pierce puts another one through. Gets some reward for her efforts. Melbourne now only trailed by 20. Back with another set of bounce. Clears the contest. She gets her hands on the footy, manufactures the handball. She can take off after that handball. Gets the loose ball, releases it under pressure. Uses the bump. It'll be a ball up. Thrashes it. Gets it away. McKinnon applying physical pressure. Thompson looking to put through another goal. Through for a point. The margin is 21. Birch with the responsibility of kicking it in. The ball goes out of bounds on the full. Normally a pretty good kick. Let's see what she can do here. Big kick required from this distance. Sinks the slipper into it. Easily takes the mark. The kick from Cordner. She takes the mark. Kicks it out of the back 50. McAvoy gets a quick kick away. We'll get a ball up on the wing. 
thump by Pierce. Gathered by O'Day. She's got the footy in her hands. Moves the ball by foot. She can put it through. Suckers a through for a goal. She sinks her first goal. She acknowledges the crowd. Momentum shifting back their way now. That's a really good team goal. She did really well there and gets the reward. Adelaide trail in the clearance numbers, but it's not a big issue for them because of their defence. Phillips picks up the loose ball. She couldn't get the hand pass away, so she just threw it. The ball finds Van Hagen. Van Hagen has resources out wide. Jacobson puts it on the boot. Hatcher wins the marking contest. Got boot to ball. Campbell clears the ball from the contest. Jones does well to mark. Uses it by foot. Marks now and can send it back. Adelaide haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning title that way. Puts boot to ball. Takes an uncontested mark. A chance to reload the attack now. Elects to kick. The loose ball picked up. Smith moves it now. Picks up the loose ball. Considine with a penetrating handball. Fantastic pressure there. Slams it onto the boot. Gathers it now. Collects the loose ball. Dug it out. Sinks the slipper into it. Jacobson takes a strong mark. It has to be a big kick to get it from there. Going for goal number one. Sometimes you just sit back and enjoy the show. She loved that one. Just under two goals the difference now. The game is back underway. Pierce with the hit. Gained some territory. Did well to get a hand in. Fights the good fight. Gets a quick kick away. He takes the mark. Looks to move it by foot. Found space for an easy mark. Finds a target. Ends up with Cox. Hits her hard. Goes short by hand. Cleanly picked up. Now we've got to set up the final way to stop the ball move. It's under two goals now. Adelaide have actually turned it over more than the opposition, but they haven't allowed that to translate into scores. It's why they're still in front. Pierce puts the handball out in front. Downey gets on the end of that handball. She likes her chances from here. Start of the kick line, and it never came back. It's under two goals now. Looking to bring it back into play. Intercepts the ball well. It has to be a big kick to get it from there. The kick will be from a 45-degree angle. Down he goes it alone. No one And it's a behind. Just under two goals the difference now. Allen ready to bring it back into play. Slams it on the boot. Ends up marking uncontested. Uses it now. Finds a target. Puts it on the boot. Just gave it away. Quick handle. Has it now. Ball off hands. She's really making an impact in this game, Gaz. Yes, I know. She's a class act. Got boot to ball. Terrific mark there. Tarrant looks to build some momentum with this kick. Fends off the tackler. Gets a touch to the ball. Uses a short handle. Gets into some space to mark this. 
decides to go. Moves the ball along the wing. Gets into a good position to take that. Getting pushed out of the way was Cox. Uses a short handball. Hatcher slams it onto the boot. Shows some physicality. She gains the possession. Cordner off the deck. Squeezes out a handball. At full stride, receives the handball. Kicks hurriedly. Ball collected. Had plenty of the ball. She outgains possession. Nails the goal. Pretty happy with that one. Adelaide lead by two goals. Back in the middle now. Thump clear. Has it now. Cramey collects the loose ball. Collected by Downey. Drops the ball. Gets the ball out of heavy traffic. Good grab there for Foley. Goes by foot. Snaffled up by Smith. Just put her hands in the back of the opponent, and it's a free. Smith drives the kick. Strong with the body, and wins the mark. Adelaide have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. What a brilliant tackle! Couldn't see off Phillips. Great tackle. She drives it towards goal. The drop punt goes straight between the big sticks. Phillips celebrates with the fans. That's two in a row for Adelaide. Adelaide by three goals. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. Some great ball movement there. Just knew they were going to score. Melbourne need to tighten up once the ball leaves the contest. The opposition are getting lots of uncontested ball and it's hurting them on the scoreboard. Foley was surrounded. She needed to mark that and she did. It's a foot race to get this one. McKinnon kicks hurriedly. Smith takes it strongly. Smith has resources out wide. Hanks controlling the airwaves on this occasion. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. Adelaide forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. Foley takes the mark. 50 metres from home. Going for goal number one. Finds a bit of room to mark. With a driving kick, takes the mark. Birch puts it out in front. Has a player running for her. Marks all along. Goes with the kick. McAvoy missed an opportunity to mark. The loose ball scooped up. Thompson with the shot. It somehow fits over the line. And it's a goal. They stretch their lead with that effort. They get around her after that effort. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. She knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. Adelaide are getting more of the ball on the outside, and it's their outside run that is generating plenty of scoring opportunities. Jones just throws. It. Drives the kick hard. Gay will be upset with that. Takes a nice mark. Keeps the kick low. Jones shows some physicality. She's got the footy in her hands. Sheer uses the body well. Might be too far out to score. Looking to kick goal number two. That goal is a cracker. Smiles all round. Adelaide by five goals. Centre bounce. 
Swatson. Fighting hard was Go Day. She gains the possession. She's got the football now. Seen plenty of it. Oh, needs to execute this shot at goal. Easily takes the mark. Looks up with the kick. She takes the mark. Chose to kick it. Taking a nice grab. Uses it across half back. Takes the mark all by herself. Handballs to a teammate on the run. Dug out the loose ball. Deciding where to go with the kick in. A spearing kick. Doing well to intercept that kick. O'Day lines up from long range. She drives it towards goal. Unbelievable. And they put it through. Celebrating hard. Back in the middle to resume play. Adelaide have gone on top in the clearances, but they're not hitting the scoreboard. If they can find a way to use their clearance ability better, they will find themselves in front. Good mark and looks to send it back. Decides to kick. Marks in a bit of space. Adelaide are getting plenty of marks with loose players. They're really able to control the game and move at their own pace. Couldn't snap it. The ball goes to ground. They can link up now. Just gets it onto the boot. Good mark there. Miffin dishes it off. The old one too. McAvoy grabbed it clean. Paxman gets on the end of this. Stabs at the kick. Does well to cut off the kick. Adelaide can manage to rack up a big number of marks. And it's easy to see why they're leading this match. Foley will be the recipient of the free. Wants to keep it moving. Just put it on the boot. Finding the loose ball was McAvoy. McAvoy won herself a free. Moves it by foot. Takes a simple grab. Moves the ball by foot. The ball ends up with Courtney. Got boot to ball. Ends up turning this ball over. Uses it by foot. Hatchard presents and takes the mark. Spears the ball. Foley gets on the end of this. Sinks the slipper into it. A strong mark in the pack from Campbell. Adelaide have got on top in the marks. They've been able to control the ball in the air. It sees them in this position. She takes aim. No issues with that drop pass. That's her third. She's doing her job there. This kick stretches the lead. Thompson getting the crowd involved. About to resume hostilities. Hammers it. She has the ball. Gives it. Don't argue. Pierce has resources out wide. A good mark under the circumstances. Miffin channels a long kick. Tarrant got under it. Elects to keep moving. Looks to move it by foot. Drops the mark. Decides to keep it alive. Campbell gets the ball out of heavy traffic. Phillips decides to play on. Picked up now. Birch applies a bump. Hacking it out of there. Shear takes advantage. Clear free. Just put both hands in the back. Shear goes with the kick. Nice mark under pressure. 40 metres out. Going for goal number one. No issues with that drop pass. Get some reward for her efforts. Adelaide could kick back-to-back -back goals. 35 points the difference. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see that she's up and about now. A great bit of play that resulted in that goal. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. Decides to kick. Scoops up the ball. Rushes with the kick. Shear takes a strong mark. 25 metres out. Lining up now. Directly in front. Move it on. She locks her chances from here. 
congratulated by her teammates. Adelaide lead by 41. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. Melbourne giving themselves a chance on the turnover, but they can't seem to be putting it on the scoreboard. Ball hits the deck. Van Hagen takes it well. It's a smashing out there at the moment, and it could get worse. Thumps it clear. Up for grabs for Phillips. Great mark in the pack. Mule for the low spearing kick. Thompson leaps over the top. Adelaide are getting plenty of marks with loose players. They're really able to control the game and move at their own pace. Doing well to intercept that kick. Puts boot to ball. Ends up marking uncontested. Moved on by Downey. Chose to kick it. Well picked up. Burr ticks it up. Cordner puts on a big hit. Hit the man hard. Applies a bump. Cordner. Free kick. Goes with the kick. Slams it on the boot. Ball spills. She heads for home. That one hits the wood. Adelaide lead is now at 42. Ready to bring it back into play. McAvoy has a great set of hands. Adelaide just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Landed in her back on this occasion. Smith pumps the ball long. Phillips looking to track down the footy. Uses it now. Tarrant found some space and marked. Alex to kick. Takes that one strongly. Drives towards half forward. Phillips sends it clear of the contest. Great grab. With a driving kick, and the mark will be paid. Moves it by foot. Mops up the loose ball. Receives the handball and takes off. Looks up with the kick. An easy grab for Haxman. Going for goal number one. Kept her head and kicked the goal. That's worthy of celebration. Yes, I know. They're right back in this one now. Oh, look at her. She really enjoyed that one. Downey gets on the end of that handball. Good mark and looks to send it back. Campbell sends one up towards the wing. Nice hands. Releases the handball. Considine finds possession. Does well to cut off the kick. Moved on by Smith. Burt takes the mark. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. Adelaide forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. Couldn't quite with the mark. She acknowledges the crowd. Centre bounce. That's it for the first half. What can you tell us, Gaz? Melbourne are going to need to find something to get them back into this match. Anything to add, Gaz? Adelaide have taken control of the outside game. They've been able to find more space in the opposition, and it's paying off. Thanks, Gaz. Halftime at the grand final with both teams' seasons on the line. Stay tuned for a big second half. The crowd's anxious. Let's get into the second half. Back with another centre bounce. Punches are clear. Taken by Godet. Goes short by hand. Packing it out of there. Off hands. This kick to keep some hope alive. Pretty happy with that one. Melbourne behind by 36. We resume hostilities. Winning it was Pierce. Goes by hand. Hatcher brilliantly steps around. Pushes off the tackler. Fans off the tackler. Moves the ball by foot. Spent that one before she earned it. It's only a behind. Lets them down there. 
Melbourne close the gap to 35. Allen to bring it in. Plays on from the kicky. Goes by foot. Just put it on the boot. Drops the ball. Mules drives it out of the pack. Thompson couldn't hang on to the ball. I haven't seen her for a while, Gaz. Maybe the coach needs to get on the phone to her and give her some instructions. Handballs. Marinoff is streaming past and gets the footy. Marks now and can send it back. Kicks it out of the back half. Finds this one all by herself. Punches the kick. Good body work to win the mark. Thompson moves it by hand. Missed the target. Kick on the way. That kick hits the post. Adelaide Lee is now 36. Birch with the kick in duties. Hurry kick. Gets a quick kick away. Great grab. Paxman sends one up towards the wing. Intercepts the ball well. Links with hands. Goes back to Phillips. Through for a point. Adelaide, over Melbourne by 37. She finds herself in space and marks. Puts it on the boot. The mark has been taken. Smith, not wasting time, elects to play on. McAvoy to take the free. Got boot to ball. The ball ends up with Ratchet. Adelaide for allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. A chance to reload the attack now. Hits the target by hand. Handball finds Campbell. Has to do better than that in the mark contest. Puts it on the boot. McKinnon runs after this one. She's on fire at the moment, Gaz. She just keeps fighting the footy. Quick handball. Takes possession. She just can't get out of the action. Terrific mark there. Opportunity once again for Melbourne to put one through. Puts on a big hit. Jacobson was taken high in the tackle. Going for goal number one. What a kick! She puts it through. She celebrates hard after that. Melbourne have kicked the last two goals. Trying to get this back to a manageable deficit now. It's great to watch Hutto. Plenty of excitement. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. The game is back underway. McKinnon with a big fist on it. The ball mopped up. Foley gets the loose ball. The umpire calls for a stoppage. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? This game needs a spark at the moment. McAvoy throws the ball away. Stabs at the kick. Down he marks it. The Crows haven't been able to set up any set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning total that one. Releases the handball. Gives it. Don't argue. Moves the ball by foot. Oh, wins the ball in the air. Chips it towards half forward. Hatcher wins the ball in the air. Channels a long kick. Dug out by Campbell. It's been turned over. Finds the loose ball. I haven't seen her for a while, Gaz. She needs to find a way into this game. Releases the handball. Ball gets cut off. Penetrating handball. The handball hits the target. A bit too hard with a push. And it's a free kick. Converting these opportunities could make a big difference to today's result. Downey will have to put everything into this one. Paul going for number one. Just leaves them in her right. Great goal. And now they're back with a chance. She's enjoying that goal. Melbourne have three in a row. Melbourne close the gap to 25. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. 
It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. Melbourne just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Adelaide got behind in the clearances, but has set up well enough defensively that it hasn't made a big impact. Downey mobs the handball. Oh, turns a free kick quickly onto the boot. Takes a strong man. Moves it by foot. Wasting a lot of effort there. Intercepted. Gets it away. Going for goal number one. That goal is a cracker. Smiles all round. They continue to tighten this game up. She knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. Melbourne need to be more efficient with their ball use. They've allowed the opposition too much influence from intercept marks. Adelaide, ruck work needs to be a bit better. Too many of their hitouts are getting sharked by the opposition. Sanger goes off the ground. A chance to soccer it and kicks the goal. She's excited about that one. They're gaining momentum here. It's great to watch her own plenty of excitement. She did really well there and gets the reward. Umpire ready to resume play. Hammers it. Doing well was gay. Downey rushes with the kick. Spills the mark. Pushes through with power. Receives the handball and takes off. Has a teammate on the move. They can create from this. Downey. Hurry kick. The mark is taken by Jacobson. 45 metres out. Going for goal number two. The kick connects with the post. Melbourne behind by 12. Allen to kick it in. Doesn't take the mark. Well collected. Takes an uncontested mark. Doesn't hold on to the mark. McKinnon slams it onto the boot. A chance to put a second goal on the board. Her teammates rush over. It's a three goal lead to Benelay. About to resume play. Thrashes it. Shear making her way onto the field. And we'll get a ball up. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? It's a really entertaining game of football. Ball picked up. Zinke collects it. Going for goal number two. Couldn't be happier with that goal. The scoreboard starting to worry Melbourne now. And we're back in motion. Pierce with the punch. Releases under pressure. McKinnon gives it to the player running past. Wins the race to the ball. Courtney links up with a chance to run. Foley is streaming past and gets the footy. Unbelievable effort. And it ends with a goal. Gets her first. She loved that one. Adelaide with the ascendancy over Melbourne, leading 104 to 86. Picked off by Marinov. Slick with the hands. Hatcher getting in on the act. Marks that ball uncontested. Adelaide have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of the game if they're to stay on top. 45 metres out. Shear looking for another goal here. Puts it right through the middle. They increase their lead. They get around there after that effort. 
Adelaide lead by 24. The Crows are making the most of their ruck dominance. It's one area of their game that seems on top here. Mills puts on a bump. Well taken at ground level. Coaches love to see that kind of tackling pressure. Kept alive under pressure. Pierce powers through the tackle. And she stepped over the boundary line. The ball is coming back into play. Clears the contest. Clean from the half volley. Mills clears the ball from the contest. Looks like the ball will be coming back. McAvoy sends one up towards the wing. Ends up turning this ball over. A low stabbing kick. Great mark under pressure. Blasted inside the 50. A good job keeping it in play there. Couldn't complete the play. Ball out of bounds. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? There's not enough effort out there at the minute. Cordner dug it out. Found space for an easy mark. Looks to move it by foot. Does well to cut off the kick. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. Adelaide forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. Smith just threw it. Collected by Jones. Decides to keep it alive. That kick goes out on the full. Running off for a break. Putting this one through would give Adelaide plenty of confidence. 45 metres out. A goal from this spot is unlikely, but it is possible. Of course, Hunter. Sense the opportunity and was able to take it. They are starting to stamp their dominance on this game. Look at them celebrate that effort. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see that she's up and about now. That's a really good team goal. Adelaide have taken charge of the contested ball. It's allowing them to create their scoring opportunities. It's marked by Terrence. Elects to kick. Marked by Jacobson. She decides to go for home, takes the chance, and says thank you very much with that goal. She's back to couple now. She celebrates hard after that. We're back in the middle. Pierre's got a fist to it. Oh, Dave! Crashes off the tackle. McAvoy just put it on the boot. Just goes bang! Gets around the imaginary opponent. Manufactures a handball at full stride. Receives the handball. She blasts it through for another. Look at them celebrate that effort. The Demons have kicked the last two goals. Margin within touching distance. Hanks onto the ball. Couldn't complete the mark. A clean picker. Now we'll get a ball up. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? There's some great skills on display right now. It's a great match. Scoops it up. Slams it onto the boot. Through for a minor score. Adelaide with a handy break. They lead Melbourne. 117 to 98. Winning the ball in the air was he. Adelaide haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect the forward to kick a winning title that way. The Crows by 20 points. Considering the options on the kick-in. Gets into some space to mark this. She spears the ball. Marks in a bit of space. Sinks the slipper into it. The ball finds Hordman. Uses it by foot. He did well to win that ball. Chose to kick it. A big contested grab. Looks up with the kick. 
just gets it onto the boot. He has had plenty of it, guys. She's been outstanding here, Hunter. The umpire calls for it. McKinnon thrashes it. Adelaide, 119. Clayton, Melbourne, 98. Ends up marking uncontested. Finding the ball was McAvoy. Jacobson goes with the kick. Strong mark in the contest. Adelaide haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning tail of that one. Goes off the ground. McKenna going for number two. Gets some reward for her efforts. The lead is now 27. Back in the middle now as the rucks go at it. Thump clear. Gay goes off the ground. Goes by hand. Is in her possession. Wants to keep it moving. Foley clicks with a teammate who can run. Kicks hurriedly. Decides to kick. Drop the marks he should have taken. Jacobson a bit too casual with the tackle. Finding the loose ball was Cox. Yet another possession. Cox throws the ball away. Cordner gets in a good position. Kicks hurriedly. Got hands to it. Picked off the deck. Sheer collects the loose ball. Sweeping handball. Hands that ball to the opposition. A good mark out of the circumstances. Got the hands free. She's getting a lot of the ball, guys. She's everywhere at the moment. So, what could Melbourne do with this opportunity in front of goal? She can put it through. Managed to get it down to that one. Teammates, break for her. Here's the body to take that mark. Adelaide crew allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Ends up turning this ball over. Good mark and looks to send it back. Allen drives a low kick. Mark by Van Hagen. Goes with the kick. Great mark under pressure. Works it across the ground. Open opportunity for Bowley. Wins the race to the ball. Dishes it off with the ball now. She gets her hands on the footy. Winning the ball in the air was he. Adelaide just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Paxman couldn't keep her hands on it. I haven't seen her for a while, Gaz. She's barely touched the ball lately. Downey kick goes inside the 50. Runs out of room and will get a throw in. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? There's not enough effort out there at the minute. Van Hagen with a penetrating handball. Picks it up. Clears the ball from the contest. Didn't disguise that well enough. It's been called deliberate. With a driving kick. A strong pack mark. Intercepts the ball very well. 45 metres out. Sanka with a pretty easy kick. A chance to put a second goal on the ball. Drop part straight through the middle. She's enjoying that goal. Melbourne reduce the margin back in the middle now Pierce hurls it away she's got the footy in her hands with quick hands Cox with the ball Thompson with the opportunity in front of goal she can put it through a drop punch through the goal goal number four with that kick they increase their lead she loved that one. This is how they can score, Big Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. The 
great bit of play that resulted in that goal. Center bounce. Big thump from Pierce. Oh, this is it off. Mithin gets a quick kick away. Doing well to intercept that kick. Van Hagen sends one up towards the wing. That'll like have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of the game if they're to stay on top. Just got the hands in the back there. Slams it on the boot. Taking a nice grab. Now with a low spearing kick. A chance to reload the attack now. Kicks it long. Terrific mark there. Downey moves it now. Zenka did well to win that ball. 50 metres out. Bit of an angle for this kick. Goes by foot. Ball offhand. She looks like she needs a spell. Mills pushes a low ball. Great control there. Pierce decides to soccer it. She takes aim. Paxman goes cleverly off the ground and kicks the goal. Look at her. She really enjoyed that one. About to resume play. Adelaide could taking advantage of the Ruckman's ability. It's giving them first use at the stoppages and forcing the opposition to defend. What did you think of the third term, Gas? This is a great grand final. Let's have a closer look at the stats. Melbourne are doing the right things at the moment. They've taken plenty of marks inside 50, but they haven't converted. And it's costing them right now. And thank you very much, Gaz. Glory awaits. Who gets up from here? Back with another set of bounce. Spots it. The ball in the hands of Phillips. Keeps it moving. Knew I was coming. It's a turnover. Intercepted. Uses a short handball. Ball picked up. Gets the loose ball. Putting her skills on display. Tariff soccer's a kid. Finds the loose ball. What a sensational goal. That's her second. She's excited about that one. The Demons now only trail by 14. We resume hostilities. Adelaide are making the most of their ruck dominance. It's one area of their game that seems on top here. Off hands from Van Hagen. Pierce suckers it forward. Off the ground. She's kicked the goal. Her teammates rush over. Just two goals in it. The Crows, Cork, are getting first use from their ruck. Marks that ball uncontested. Slams it under the boot. Takes it well. The kick from Axman. Tara cuts it off. This is kickable by her standards. Normally a good shot on goal. Tara a long way out. Marks now and can send it back. Gets a hand to the ball. Use the hands and gives away the free. Van Hagen puts it on the boot. Phillips works onto that ball. Uses it now. A great mark taken there. Thompson with a spearing kick. They can just slow the game down now. Take a bit of time off the clock. Smith gets the loose ball. Jacobson takes a strong mark. Puts boot to ball. Campbell hangs on to that one. Adelaide are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Intercepted by Jones. Pushes off the tackle. McKinnon receives the ball. She has the ball. Linking by hand. The ball ends up going to ground. Oh, what about that? That was really special. Puts through her third goal. Congratulations.
congratulated by her teammates. We're back in the middle. Thumps it clear. Putting on the bump was Zenka. Pierce kicks hurriedly. Umpire pays the free for a deliberate. Cox making her way onto the field. Got boot to ball. Good mark by McKinnon. Goes by foot. Paxman heads onto the ground. Lots of pressure out there at the minute. Punches it clear. Considine just gets a boot to it. Just dismisses her opponent. Lobs the handball. Linking by hand. Big moment to get the lead with this kick. Oh, loves that goal. That's five in a row for Melbourne. They've taken the lead. Punched away. She gains the possession. McKinnon gets on the end of that handball. Scoops up the ball. Slips the handball to Cordner. Oh, just gets it onto the boot. Campbell uses the body well. Gets a hand to the ball. Mops up the loose ball. Quickly onto the boot. Good mark. And looks to send it back. Drives the kick hard. Ends up turning this ball over. Mills collects the kick. Hagen struggling to run at the moment. Marinov takes the mark out contested. Moves the ball by foot. Stands tall and marks. Allen drives the kick. Nice work from McKinnon. Uses it now. Campbell hacking it out of there. Foley used the body to take that mark. Puts boot to ball. She gives chase to the footy. Picked up now. Thank you. Zanka thumped it clear. Difficult ball. Control. Slips the tackle. Decides to kick. Mules got up, but couldn't bring it down. Haven't seen her for a while, Gaz. You're right, Hutto. She's gone missing lately. Gets a quick kick away. Takes an uncontested mark. Marks now and can send it back. Smith uses it by foot. Foley goes for territory. Handballs is in her possession. They could take the lead here. Thompson kicks an incredible goal off the ground. Celebrating hard. They're in front. Back in the middle now as the rucks go at it. Zanka gets onto the ball. Oh, on the ball. Stuck the mitts out there and held onto it. Ball gets cut off. Drives it out of the pack. A chance to steal the lead right here. She acknowledges the crowd. Melbourne steal back the lead. Back in the middle to resume play now. Pierce clears the contest with the ball now. Hanks quickly onto the boot. Using every ounce of energy she has left. Campbell not getting much of a gas. She hasn't had the impact we were expecting. Tara turns a free kick. Move it on. She likes her chances from here. Nobody can hold on here. Hatcher picks up the loose ball. Didn't get away from the tackle. Great tackling technique. The mark has been taken. Foley kicks it. Stands tall and marks. Hatcher flicks it over. Mills links up with a chance to run. Adelaide would love to make the most of this opportunity. Thompson lining up now for goal number six. Bad finish result in the bottom. 
Adelaide now only trailed by three. Searching for a teammate. Plays on to herself. Elects to kick. Considine. Gains some territory. Finds a way to go along the ground. Thompson couldn't be happier with that goal. Adelaide. Go back in the lead again. Pierre's got a fist to it. Scoops it up. That tackle just too high. Goes with the kick. Just gets it out of the boot. Keeps the kick low. Gets into some space to mark this. She gets above the crowd. Moved on by Katja. Intercepts the ball very well. She doesn't want to let her teammates down with this shot at goal. Towards centre half forward. Takes that one stronger. 45 metres out. O'Day has a chance to put a second goal on the board. They get around her after that effort. Melbourne goes back in front. She knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. She did really well there and gets the reward. Adelaide are winning the ball around the contest but aren't converting it into scores. They need to find a way to use it better on the outside. McKinnon coming onto the ground. And now we'll have a ball up. Oh, it's tense out there at the moment, Hutto. It's a turnover. Taken by Cramey. Goes by hand to Hanks. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Pierce won the hit out. Soccer's a kick. Goes off the ground. Paxman goes off the ground. Goes off the deck and through. Downey enjoying that goal. That's two in a row for Melbourne. Now they lead by nine. The game is back underway. It's been a clearance game and right now Melbourne go on top in that area. Wants to play on. Doing well with the mark. McKinnon will kick from beyond the 50. She heads for home. Takes the mark. Uses it by foot. Hank wins the ball in the air. Slams it on the boot. Great mark. Just kicks it long. Stuck the mitts out there and held onto it. Pierce wins the marking contest. Puts it on the boot. Takes a nice mark. Elected to play on. Tarrant didn't mark it. Hank can't hold on to the tackle. Considine takes it strongly. A spearing kick. Oh, just put it on the boot. With a driving kick. Looks like it's going to be paid deliberate. Stab kick from Mithen. A chance to put one through here for Melbourne. Oh, elects to kick. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Foley has resources out wide. The game has tightened right up. McKinnon just swats it away. Gathers it now. Oh, gets in the way. Goes by hand to Jacobson. Easily takes the mark. And the mark will be paid. Goes short by hand. Can't take possession. Haven't seen her for a while, Gaz. Maybe the coach needs to get on the phone to her and give her some instructions. Dug out the loose ball. Releases by hand. Takes possession. That looked great. What a goal. Pretty happy with that one. The slimmest of margins in this. Thump clear. 
practicing some fancy moves. Cramey quickly onto the boot. Hatcher gets on the end of this. Chips it towards half forward. Gets into a good position to take it. Nice mark under pressure. 30 metres from home. An ideal position to be kicking from. They'll snatch the lead if this goes through. Phillips love kicking that one. They're in the lead now. Back in the middle now. Punched away. Has it now. Just put it on the boot. A solid mark from Hatcher. Chose to kick it. Campbell marks in a bit of space. Gives it to Phillips. Opportunity for Foley. Pierce wins it back. Gets the handball away. Collects the loose ball. She can take off after that handball. She's really making an impact in this game, Gaz. She's everywhere at the moment. 50 metres from home. Elects to kick it long. Finds a target. She drives it towards goal. Brilliant stuff. And she puts it through. Goal number four with that. Smiles all round. They've hit the front. Umpire ready to resume play. Thrashes it. Gets on the end of this. Rushes with the kick. She seems to be struggling at this stage. It might be time for a break. Oh, Dave takes it well. Movement by hand. Manages to get a hand away. Pierce just gets it onto the boot. Allen has it. A long driving kick. A great mark taken there. Looks to move it by foot. I haven't seen her for a while, Gaz. She needs to find a way into this game. Van Hagen goes off the ground. They can create from this. Clumsy tackle results in a free kick. It bounces to the advantage of the opposition. A chance to reload the attack now. Manages to get a hand to it. Picked up under pressure. Campbell dominating this game. She's been outstanding here, Hutter. Eventually, the ball goes over the line. The players will be feeling it out there. Just gives it away. Marinoff is streaming past and gets the footy. Doesn't take the mark. Sinks the slipper into it. Charges with intent. Goes off the ground. Picks up the loose ball. Adelaide behind by two. Birds looking to bring it back into play. The kick releases the pressure, keeps it in play. Never on time, out of behind. Adelaide close the gap to one. Deciding where to go with the kick in. Birds plays it to herself. Hacks it on the boot. She's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. She decides to go for home. Oh, it just hits the post. It's all level here. Bird players move as they look to provide an option. Moves it by foot. O'Day marks uncontested. Jacobson hacking it out of there. Well collected. Contest the hard ball. Applying the physical pressure. Contest the hard ball with quick hands. Gets it out of congestion. Cordner drops the mark. Looks up with the kick. Now it's a ball. Pierce with a big fist on it. Did well to control the ball. She just throws that ball. Kick by Hall. Doing well to intercept that kick. Slams it on the boot. A strong mark in the pack from Bowley. Adelaide fans would love to see this one sail through. Going for goal number one. That was sweet. They put through another. Pretty happy with that one. Adelaide with the ascendancy over Melbourne, leading 165 to 159. Hammers it. Loses control of the ball. Paxman, hurried kick. 
didn't disguise that well enough. It's been called deliberate. Allen drives the kick. A big contested grab. Pokes it short in the back pocket. Jones has a great set of hands. With a driving kick. Mules with the mark. Found a way to keep balance. Picking it up was Heath. Hands that ball to the opposition. Oh! Wins the foot race. Can't take the mark. Needs a bit of a rest. Showed her opponent the ball and took off. McKinnon gives the old don't argue. She decides to go for home. What a kick. And she puts it through. Proving to be the match winner right now. Six goals. They get around there after that effort. And we're back in motion. Pierce thumps it forward. Jones uses the bump. Missed the target. Releases by hand. She can take off after that handball. The mark is taken by Foley. 45 metres out. She takes aim. The drop part sails between the big sticks. That's two now. Finding her feet in front of goals. She celebrates hard after that. That's a really good team goal. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. Oh, links up with a chance to run. Couldn't take it. Gay is having a stellar match. She's been superb today, Hutto. Snaffled up by Jones. Ball collected. Hacking it out of there. Strong mark in the contest. Takes a few deep breaths before this important kick. Regic decides to go it alone. The drop part goes straight between the big sticks. Look at them celebrate that effort. The Crows could kick back-to-back -back goals. Adelaide by two goals. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. Melbourne need to tighten up once the ball leaves the contest. The opposition are getting lots of uncontested ball and it's hurting them on the scoreboard. Adelaide, good balance. The celebrations are underway. What a way to win a premiership. You can see it in the faces of these 22 players that they gave it everything they had. Both sides had their chances to stamp their authority on this one, but in the end, it was the finishing skills inside 50 that gave us the result. No matter how hard a team goes at it during the match, there's always energy left for the celebration. They worked so hard for this, and now it's time to celebrate. It's every player's dream to be doing what this team is doing right now. They are soaking up the moment after winning the grand final. Just a moment for the fans right now, and look at them joining the celebrations. Thanks for joining us, Gaz, but that's all we have time for. Thanks, Hutto. I've enjoyed every minute of it.